Turns out even hero dogs can be naughty when it comes to having their photo taken. We got there in the end thanks to some tactical ball waving by the owners. We'll let them off though because every single one of them is remarkable. Let's start with Asher. He was a rescue dog who'd had numerous owners due to his big personality. But then he came to Claire from the charity Medical Detection Dogs. And now he can sniff out disease and illness. He's so good that what we do is if we want to, as a charity, we want to find out whether a particular disease or condition has an odour, we train Asher to find it first. The most recent disease he's been trained to find is actually COVID-19 and he could find that with up to 95% accuracy. He's sniffing you now, he always does. He's sniffing gives, me. Yeah, gives everybody a sniff just to, just to Am check. I all right? <laughs> I hope I'm just, all right. Just a, it's, a, it's a sort of <laughs> habit now, isn't it? You have he says, I am all right. Not sure how he told her, but I'll take his tail wag for it. All of these dogs are amazing though. There's Stella the Staffy, who's changing the image of the breed by working as a police dog and Albert, who supports his owner who has a chronic illness. Beauty once saved her owner from drowning when he fell into deep water and has recently looked after 11-year-old Lily when she was treated for leukaemia. I think she's a hero dog because she saved me from being sad all the time and she made me happy. Um, and whenever I was angry and I didn't want to speak to my parents, whenever she walked in the room, she always made me smile. And then there's Bertie. His owner has been sleeping in a tent for over 700 nights to raise money for abandoned Romanian dogs. And Bertie has been keeping him company. Each night, um, he waits outside by the door to run outside, go into the tent, and he makes me want to do it even more because I can't just leave him out there. Um, but he's a great companion. He helps me continue, and I great. He's a, he's a great buddy as well. He makes a cracking hot water bottle too. The winner will be decided at Crufts in March, but each of them is the best dog in the world to their owners. Can I tell you a secret about newsrooms? The dog story is normally seen as the short straw, unless you're me, in which case it's a golden ticket. Come on, Bertie, do you want your sick? Good boy. Yes, he's a good boy. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm falling. <laughs> That'll teach me. Ruth Lipchot, 5 News with a dirty coat.